You give a safe haven to these designers to nurture, to grow, and to make an impact in the Canadian fashion industry. How do you find is the first fashion in Jamaica that we know? Because we've got Kate Dixon and um, Miriam Baker and Sid Nigam and Matthew Gallagher and Amy Dress, Lady Gaga, for God's sake. Yeah, there was funny moments, there was that there were tense moments. Congratulations. 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 Congrats. Here's to 30 more years and us being a global fashion capital, which we deserve. Sold out TFI event. Woo! Helping us celebrate tonight, I see Gemini Award winning Alex Ross. Congratulations. 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 Martinez, Chair of the TFI Board of Directors. <laughs> Our past chair, Lori <laughs> And of course, the TFI event would not be complete without the always positive and politically correct Lori Jackson from the City of Toronto. In 1987, when the City of Toronto founded TFI, who would have thought that we would be around 30 years later? Continuing our mandate to nurture, support, and promote new and emerging fashion entrepreneurs. For any organization or business for that matter, to exist 30 years later, it's pretty astounding. Institution in this country, TFI Toronto Fashion Incubator. TFI through the incredible leadership of
$1.5 million for charity tag. So it's that kind of activism, that kind of engagement with her city. Thank you, Mayor Tory. I'm truly humbled by your introduction. Providing vital support for the Canadian fashion industry is why it has been my honor to personally fund this award since 2012. My acknowledgments must be given to Susan with heartfelt thanks for your tremendous ongoing commitment to TFI. Michael Zoffriani. <laughs> Congratulations, uh, Michael.